गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग टीचर गुड पार्टनर्स Tengo la rara sospecha que hoy no vamos a ver muchos señores. Good evening, people. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Hey, partners. Good evening. Good evening. How are you, people? Good. Very good. Okay, let's get it started tonight. It is time. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, compañeros. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay. Let's see. Today is use Thursday, Friday, Monday, Tuesday.
Tuesday, Tuesday. Okay. Um, okay, please turn on your cameras and respond when you hear your name. Okay. Ana Celia Mena. Ana Maria Marcela Siu. Oh, they are working. Andrea Carolina Ortiz. Working. Blanca Isabel Tunaca. Chat. Diana Vanessa López. Oh, where are you? Where is everyone? Edgar Eduardo García. Present. Okay, finally, primero. Edith Maritza Gómez. Fernando Salvador Figueroa. Present teacher. Okay, good. Gerson Orlando Deodanes. Present. Okay. Glenda Margarita Ortiz. Glenda Margarita. Irma Mercedes Flores. Present teacher. Okay, good. Juan Alberto Castillo. Johnny Alexander Escobar. Present teacher. Good. Jocelyn Angelina Ramirez. Manuel Alberto Mena. Present. Miguel Ángel Romero. Present. Okay. Oscar René Molina. Present teacher. Good. Rafael Antonio Martínez. Raúl Enrique Campos. Nosotras somos, digamos. Nosotras somos. Michael y Gabriela. Rodrigo Enrique Hernández. Present. 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 Wow. Wow. Are they twins, Rodrigo? Yes. Wow. How old are they? Hola, three years old. Three years old. Three years old. Ah. And what are your names? My name is Gaby. My name is Gabriela Marcela. Hello, Gabriela. Hello, Marcela. Hello. Hello. Hey, people, say hello to Gabriela and Marcela. Hello. Uh, come on, people, say hello. Hello. Hello, Gabriela. Bueno, ya con él reponemos las que hacen falta, ya ven. Estamos completos. Ana Lizette Pérez, Never Show Up, y Josué Valmore Cruz. Not here. Wow. How many absentees tonight? Can you go ya? Blanca Isabel. Blanca Isabel. Present. Okay. Again, mass. Two, four, six, eight, ten only. 
y Raúl que no contesta. Ok, people, let's see. Last class, we finished talking about our obligations at work or obligations in general at home. Things that you have to do. Yeah, things that you have to do. Oh, let me show you this. Okay, this. this. Here. Have to. So, aquí puede ser have to o también se aplica para need to. ¿Verdad? Como ya lo vimos. We studied the affirmative form. Yeah. I have to travel. You have to travel. He has to travel. She has to travel. It has to travel. We have to travel. They have to travel. Okay, so please remember that with he, she, and it, we are going to use has. Okay? With he, she, and it, we use has. And with I, you, we, they, we use have. Okay? I have to get up early tomorrow. I have to go to San Salvador today. Okay. Now, I want to show you the negative form. I told you that we were going to see this. Como hablar de las cosas que no son my obligation. Okay, so I don't have to, I don't have to, for example, I don't have to travel, okay, you don't have to travel, but with he, she, and it, you observe, we're going to use the scent, okay, doesn't. He doesn't have to travel. He doesn't have to travel. He doesn't have to travel. Okay? Then with we and they, we return to don't. We don't have to travel. They don't have to. Okay? Any question with this, with affirmative and negative people? No questions? Okay. If you don't have questions, I want you to write uh, some activities that are not your responsibility at work. For example, let's talk about me. I don't have to collect the student's documents. Document. Yes? I don't have to collect the student's documents. That is not my responsibility. This program. I don't have to uh, 
call human resources for uh, or to report some problem. Yeah, that is not my responsibility. I don't have to call human resources in your company okay, uh, to report some problem. Okay, because in this English program, for example, when a student doesn't show up to class, when a student no aparece in class, people from English Corporativo call human resources. Yeah. Mire, fulanito de tal no está entrando a las clases, ¿verdad? Por favor, de recursos humanos, dígale que tiene que entrar. Y ahí van y le dicen. Okay. Now, let's talk about somebody else. A third person. Mario doesn't have to eh, what Prepare the lessons. Yeah. Mario doesn't have to prepare the lesson. Mario doesn't have to teach the class. Okay. So I want you to write activities that are not your responsibility at work and two activities about another person in your company that are not their responsibility like this example two activities that are not your responsibility in your company and two activities about another person, or the other person. Activities that no son responsibilidad de cualquier otra persona en el trabajo. Okay? Write those sentences, please. I will give you 10 minutes to do it individually. Any question? Sorry, teacher. Uh, uh -huh. ¿Cuántas dijo que hiciéramos? Two about you and okay. two about another person. Okay. Four in total. Yes. Four cents. Thank you. Thank you. I will write the examples in the chat. Please, when you finish, raise your hand.
Paul. Ah, los ponemos en el chat de una vez, teacher, o, o usted va a ir diciendo quién lo muestra o, o lo lee. Ya, he leído, ¿no? Ok. Okay, I'm, I will send you to working groups. Read your sentences in your groups, please. Okay, join your groups and practice.
Okay, I'd like to hear some of your sentences, or all of your sentences actually. So please, let's start with Oscar. Okay. And I don't have to cleaning the office. Two, I don't have to job the gardeners. Three persons is Fred doesn't have a at work. Lola doesn't have to work long hour. Okay. Can you repeat the first one, please? First. Okay. I don't have to clean the office. I don't have to? Cleaning. The verb must be in the base form. Clean. Yes. Clean. Ah, okay. Sorry. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay, very good. Edgar. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't have to call the clients. I don't have to get to work on Saturdays. Uh, my co-worker, Catherine does not have, no, Catherine does, does have to do reports in the morning. Catherine does not, no, Catherine does have to open the company. Okay. But that's Tomala. not, that's okay. not. Ah, yo no sé por qué la decías y después lo quitabas, el does not. Es que fíjense que me, como que se me, 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 me trago ahí en la, por ejemplo, repeat, repeat teacher. Catherine does, does, nothing, okay. Does not have to open the company. Okay. En mi mente está aquello de que tengo que pronunciar el not. Entonces okay. ya eso como que me traba, ya me. Ok. Me, Separado me... es does not. Does not. Uh -huh. Unido, doesn't. 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 Okay. ok, ticha. Ok. Sí, gracias. Miguel. Okay. Uh, I I don't have to make coffee in the office. I, I don't have to take care of my home garden. Orlando doesn't have to drive at work. Fernanda doesn't have to cook in the morning. Okay, very good. Anka. Okay. I don't have to do my accounting homework. I don't have the side what to do the shopping. It has been very nice to me. They have been talking on the phone for hours. No, no capté ahí la última. Repeat the last one, please. Repítame la última. They have been. They haven't. No, 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 no. no. They. They don't. They don't have been talking on the for how they don't have no, ahí, está, ahí está confundiendo dos cosas una cosa es I don't have 
Y otra cosa es I have. Son dos cosas diferentes. No es lo mismo. Cuando usamos el don't have. They, they, don't, they don't have. No. Sí. Pero they don't have. Luego usted me dice been talking on the phone. Talking on the phone y algo más. They don't have been talking on the phone. No, esa, esa forma no existe. Mm. As, lo que usted quiere decirme es ellos no han estado hablando en el teléfono durante horas exacto, entonces esa es otra cosa mm. ¿verdad? they haven't es correcto, they haven't pero no es lo que estamos viendo mm. they haven't been talking on the phone ellos no han estado hablando en el teléfono. Eso no es lo que estamos viendo. Uh -huh. Usando otra forma. Ellos no han estado. Y aquí estamos usando el have to como para hablar de mis obligaciones. Tengo que. I want. Y esa frase que usted me pone no le podemos meter. I don't have. Yo no tengo que he estado hablando en el teléfono. No. Explico. La, la idea que usted quiere transmitir es correcto cuando dice ah, they haven't been talking on the phone. Mm -hmm. Eso está bien. Ellos no han estado hablando en el teléfono. Aquí no, ahí no cabe. En esa frase no cabe el don't have. De ninguna manera. El don't have es otra cosa que tiene que decir. Yo no tengo que hacer tal cosa. Yo no tengo que. ¿Verdad? Es, es otra cosa diferente a el have. ¿Ok? Ok. No problem. Uh, let's continue with Miguel. ¿Qué pasó, Miguel? Ya te okay. I don't have to take the client's assistance. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't have to write a financial report. Yeah. Bye, amor. Okay. Ok, Johnny. Wait, teacher, please. Ok, right now. I don't have to send email the boss. I don't have to call the clients. Um, third person, Karen doesn't have to write reports daily. Albert doesn't have to drive the truck. Perfect. Very good. Thank you, teacher. Manuel? Uh, I don't have to call the potential client. I don't have to collect money from client um, or credit. And that the other person, she doesn't know how to do the financial report and he doesn't have to pay the taxes of the company. Perfect, very good. Person? Ivan? Fernando? Oh, 
Hello, teacher. Okay. Um, uh, I don't have to call the sales staff. Uh, I don't have to file reports this week. Other person is, uh, he don't have to check the bike. Como se dice vehículos, teacher? Vehicles. 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 Sería, he don't have to check the vehicles. And he don't, he does not to prepare safe report. Bueno, a ver, otra vez la última. He does, does not to prepare says reports report he does not have to prepare sales report yes lo siento sí, he still have to okay okay Harrison sí. I don't have to repair computer I don't have to clean each floor in the company. Jose, zero person, Jose doesn't, doesn't, doesn't talk with, with the user. Jose doesn't write the documentation of the product. If they come in, they'll have to. Doesn't have to. Es cierto, es cierto. Me voy a repetir. Jose doesn't have to talk with, with the user. Jose doesn't have to write documentation of the product. Okay. Ahora sí. Very good. Thank you. Now, do, 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 do. we have this. Let me show this. There are some sentences to practice. Second, is it what's up? Okay, ahí lo tienen. Is this exercise? This exercise, okay. Fill in the blanks to complete. Oh. Fill in the ah. Oh, okay. Fill in the blanks below to complete the sentences. Use the words in the above box. Okay, for example, let me show you. Today is a holiday. I, I don't have to go to work. I don't have to go to work. Don't have to go to work. Okay. So, ah, well, let me mostrar this todavía porque aquí hay preguntas. Bueno, ¿cómo le pregunto a alguien si tiene que hacer algo? Now, look at this chart here. Do I have to travel? Do you have to travel? Does he have to travel? Does she have to travel? Does it have to travel? Do we have to travel? Do they have to travel? Tengo que yo que viajar? Tienes tú que viajar? 
tiene él que viajar. Yeah. When he or she or it, vamos a usar does. De nuevo, ¿no? Are you with they? We use do. ¿Y cómo se responde esta pregunta? Si yo te pregunto, do you have to uh, call the clients? Oh, yes, I do. Or, no, I don't. Do you have to work tomorrow? <coughs> yes, I do. Do you have to visit the, uh, the doctor? No, I don't. Okay. Son las preguntas. Así que eh, ya les puse ahí en el WhatsApp. You have this exercise in WhatsApp. I will give you time to work on these sentences. You have to complete these sentences, okay? Do it in groups, please. Let me form groups again. Two smaller groups. Okay. Go to your groups and complete that exercise with don't have, doesn't have, or the question form. Mm -hmm. okay. I'll give you 10 minutes to do it. Clients. Join your groups, please. Deja. Vamos a ver si la puedo pasar a otra. Teacher. Pasar a Word? Ah, ya llegó el teacher. Hola. Eh, eh, don't, I don't can share. No, no sé si sería así. You can. You can share, ok. No. Queríamos compartir la pantalla. No yeah, se podía. Yeah. Ya les habilité ahorita. Dale, Thank Gerson. you, teacher. Ahorita le confer. Okay. okay. Perfect. Me avisan cuando lo puedan ver. Sí. Yes, I see. Mm. Ahí está.
you and your sisters, you and your sister, se dice tú y tu hermana. Do you and your sister. Uh -huh. No, es sí. eh, solamente you and your sister. Pero es que creo que sería en pregunta. Do you? Dice Ana, sí, a doctor, because she is. No. Ana. Ana. Ah, ah, sí, Ana, Ana has to. Ana das. Ana, Ana has to. Ana verá al doctor porque ella está, ella se encuentra, ella eh, is, is not feeling well. Feeling, feeling. He isn't. He isn't feeling well. La ocho sería extreme. I have. I have. I have to have to I have to answer my phone. Mm -hmm.
Okay, people, let's check. Let's see. Okay, we said the number one, the Himos, today is a holiday. The Himos, I... Here, in the second attempt. On, uh, oh, yes, 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 yes. I don't have to... Uh... Teacher. Hola. Uh, menos más tiempo. <laughs> más tiempo, ah, okay. No, mentira. No sé si se puede, este teacher. Colo, colo. Así como estamos con el grupo. Es que hasta las 10 llegamos ahí. Vamos a ver. Avanzaron, nosotros hasta las 4. Ah, no le creo. Está bien. Bueno, vamos con la segunda asistencia. Ana Celia Mena. Ana María Marcela Siu. Present. Ok, Andrea Carolina Ortiz. Present. Good. Blanca Isabel Tunaca. Present. Ok, Diana Vanessa López. Edgar Eduardo García. Present teacher. Ok, Tit Maritza Gómez. Fernando Salvador Figueroa. Present teacher. Ok, Gerson Orlando de Odanes. Present. Ok, Glenda Margarita Ortiz. Irma Mercedes Flores. Present teacher. Ok, Iván Alberto Castillo. Present teacher. Ok, Johnny Alexander Escobar. Here we go. Angelina Ramírez. Mute you your microphone, please. Thank you. Manuel Alberto Mena. Present. Good. Miguel Ángel Romero. Present. Ok. Oscar René Molina. Present, teacher. Good. Rafael Antonio Martínez. Raúl Enrique Campos. Rodrigo Enrique Hernández. Present. Ok. Ana Lizette Pérez. And Josué Balmore Cruz. Okay, let's do it together. Primero dijimos, I don't have to work. Don't have to work. Number two. Let's see, Miguel. Give me number two. Microphone. Sorry, uh, does your sister have to go to school today? Does your sister have to go to school today? Okay, good. Uh, let's see, Oscar, number three. My mother doesn't have to go to the post office now. Doesn't have to. ¿Qué dicen los demás? Bueno, puede ser, aplique. Se ve bien. Aunque me suena más el has to. Afirmativo que negativo. Ah. Uh. 
Por eso no nos aguantó. <laughs> My mother doesn't have to go to the post office. Pasa. No, no sé, no. Nosotros la pusimos en negativo. Sí, es que las negativas como que tienen alguna explicación, algo ahí. Estamos, Estamos confundidos, claro. teacher. Sí. No, simplemente así le interpretaron ustedes la frase. No tiene que ir al... Uh -huh. ¿Verdad? Tiene sentido, o sea, sí está bien armada. Ah, ok. Es Ok, number four, uh, Edgar. I don't have, I don't have to study. If, I don't have to study for the grammar test tomorrow. Pero ¿por qué negative? Ah, es como no me quiero, no me, como yo la consideré así, este teacher, eh, como algo que no tenía por qué prepararse para el examen de mañana. <risa> Así, así, literalmente así la, 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 la comprendí. Ajá, pero ¿por qué? O sería... Lo mismo, con la, ah. lo mismo con la anterior, o sea, si yo sí. pongo eso, sí, está, suena bien, pero el ejercicio, la oración no da ninguna razón para pensar en algo negativo. Ah, ok. Igual, fíjense que la, la que acaba de responder, Oscar, la, la consideramos como negativa. Es que vivimos en un país negativo. Eh, correcto. <risa> teacher, teacher, lo que pasa es que creo que nos confundimos como estábamos haciendo las oraciones en negativo, creo que eh, seguimos la tendencia de alguna manera. Ah, bueno, por, por ahí quizá. El chip, el chip se quedó pegado quedó, ahí en lo negativo. Quedó, sí, quedó en negativo. <risa> Ajá, entonces. Perdón, teacher, yo, yo consideraba que el, creo que mal entendí la indicación también porque pensé que todas la íbamos a escribir en negativo. No, 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 sí, era ejercicio de todo, afirmativo, negativo. Ah, ok, ok. Thanks, teacher. Okay. Sí, porque las que son negativas tienen una, como un extra que nos hace entender que es negativo. Por ejemplo, today is a holiday. Me da la idea que I don't have to go to work. Okay. Esa sí está bien ahí. Está bien. A entender Porque es, es negativo. Ok. Ajá, Rodrigo. Rodrigo, veo que está levantando la mano. No, ya no. Ok, a ver, sigamos con... ¿Con quién íbamos? Eh... Do they have... Get, get up early every... Morning. Do they? Pero quería have. Have to get up. Ah, have to. Do they have to get up early tomorrow or every morning? Yes, they? Sería. Do. Yes. Sí, do. Yes, they do. Okay. A ver, Oscar, number six. Hasta ahí no llega a Mosticher, pero la vamos a hacer positiva. Es <laughs> negativo. Patrick. Ah. Ah. Yes. Ah. Sí, es negativo. Patrick, ajá, uh, doesn't. Doesn't have. To try to destroy. To try to store. Ah. Si puedo tomar el budis. Yes. <risa> Él puede tomar el bus. Ahí es donde nos da una pauta para uh -huh. hacer la negra. Uh -huh. Ok. Sí. Eh, Blanca, number seven. And Dos. see a doctor because she isn't feeling Dos. good. Has to. Has to. Ah, ok. And ask to see a doctor because he's not feeling well. Yeah. Next. Number eight. Me. And dijo me. Me. Edgar. Me. Hey, Edgar. Excuse me. I have to answer the phone. My phone. Yes, I have to. 
answer the my phone. La única Good. que me salió buena. <laughs> A ver, number nine. Quien quiera. Nadie quiere. Me. Hey. Do you do you do you have do you have to listen? Li, no. Do you have to live soon? Hey. Have to. Yo estaba ahí, no me acuerdo. I have hey, you. 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 Solamente you. have, but teacher. Have to. Do you have to leave soon? Okay. My friend take a driving test this afternoon. Has to, teacher. Has to, yes. Camels drink water for a long time. Have to. Doesn't have to. Ah, es negativo, pero... Tiene como cinco estómagos. <laughs> bueno. ¿Sí? ¿Doesn't have to? Yes, teacher. ¿Seguros? They don't have to. Ah, ¿por qué? Es afirmativa. Porque es animal, teacher. No, es plural. Camels. Es plural. plural yes. Camels don't have to drink. Yes, that's the reason. <coughs> Camels don't have to. Yes, because it's plural. They. Okay. Number 12, my sister. Has to. Como? Has to. Okay, has to. Teacher appointment is a uh, caries. O como no. se podría traducir? Okay. Appointment cita. es una cita. Cita. Ah, okay. Cita, pero cita como médica. Como consulta. No, cita de del seguro <ríe> a los seis meses es que lo, bueno hay, igual aquí se usa no una cita romántica no eso es otra cosa es the date es una date no existe una en date. eso es una date claro que sí <ríe> astronaut bring food and water into space Does not have to. Have to. Eh, teacher is don't, don't have to. Don't have to. Excuse me. Oh, y como van a hacer? Has to. Have no. to. Sería have to nada más. Ah, have to. 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 Sí, porque have es to. ellos. Ellos. Ah, por, plural. <laughs> Okay, 14. He have to study now? Does. Ah. Does. Does he have to study now? Yes, he? Does. 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 And 15. Do you really make so to. much noise? Has to. Has? Have. Have to. Ah, have to. You really have to make so much noise? Hey. Okay. Yeah, Any question, people? No? No, Here. teacher. Clear. Creo que no, ahí creo que no, no creo que todos estemos tan claros. <coughs> ya estaba confundido con la negativa, pero 
Ahí es cuando entran los plurales, los singulars. Nos confundimos más, ¿eh? <ríe> No, abrimos más posibilidades a confundirnos. Sí. Es este cuadrito, ¿eh? Ahí está. Yo, yo por ejemplo, la, la número nueve, eh, demasiado espacio para esas palabritas, entonces... Ajá, tiende a confundir. Lo, lo, que lo, lo, lo hace texto. pensar a uno. Ajá, ¿qué, qué tanto va ahí de...? Esa es la universidad, en la universidad le decían cascarita. Cascarita. <risa> ahí la clave, la clave es que es una pregunta, compañero. Sí, sí, sí. Sí. sí, pero da trabajo quererla armar, la, la, la interrogante. Querer, querer llenar todo ese espacio. Ah, uh -huh. claro. Y con letra pequeña. <risa> <risa> ok, let's practice. Repeat, please. Today's a holiday. I don't have to go to work. Today, today is a holiday. holiday. I have, to, have, have to, to, go go to, work. to work. To work. Does your sister have to go to school today? Does, Does your, your sister, sister have, have to, to go to school to today? today? My mother doesn't have to go to the post office now. My, My mother, mother doesn't, doesn't have, have to, to go, go to the post office, post office now. Office now. Uh, uh, uh. I have to study for the grammar test tomorrow. I have, I to, have, have the to study for the, for the grammar, grammar test, test tomorrow. tomorrow. Do they have to get up early every morning? Yes, they do. Do they have to get up early, early, early every morning? morning? Yes, do they do. Yes, yes, they do. Patrick doesn't have to drive to the store. He can take the bus. Patrick, Patrick does not have to drive to the store. He has a bus. Anne has to see a doctor because she isn't feeling well. Anne has, has to see, see a, doctor a doctor because she isn't feeling, feeling well. well. Feeling well. Excuse me, I have to answer my phone. Excuse, Excuse me. me. I have, I have, have to have my, my phone. Do you have to leave soon? Do you, Do you have, have to leave soon? leave soon? My friend has to take a driving test this afternoon. My, my, my friend, friend has, to has to take, take a, a driving, 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 driving test this afternoon. This afternoon. Camels don't have to drink water for a long time. Camels don't have to drink water for a long time. My sister has to see a dentist. She has an appointment. My, My sister, sister has, has to see a dentist. She has, has an appointment. appointment. Astronauts have to bring food and water into space. Astronauts have to bring, to bring water, and water, and water into space. Water. <laughs> Does he have to study now? Yes, he does. Does he have to study now? Yes, he does. Do you really have to make so much noise? Do you, Do you really, really have, have to make, make so much noise? noise? So much noise? No. no. Okay, very good. <clears throat> the links on para ustedes en sus tiempos libres de ocio no 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 quiero que queden como There you have a couple of links. 
some exercises to practice. And that is for, for your free time. Okay, now let me, let's see a book. Let's go directly. Because according to the book, we have to study this vocabulary about months of the year and the ordinal numbers and the dates. Okay, let's practice this vocabulary about months of the year. Let me record the pronunciation here in WhatsApp. Month of the year, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Okay. Let's practice. Repeat after me, please. January. 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 February. February. March. 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 April. 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 May. 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 June. 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 July. July, July. August. August. August, August, September, September, September. October. October, October, November, November, November. December. December, December, okay. When is a uh, Mother's Day? May. May. In May. May. In May. In May. In May. In, in, in May. May. No, Lin May. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's big difference. Yeah. Okay. When is um, St. Valentine's? February. 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 Okay. When is Father's Day? In June. 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 In June. In June. In June. When is New Year? December. In January. 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 Oh, January. Oh, yeah. sorry. Hey, man. Just, just. Lost. Okay. When is Christmas? December. In December. December. When is Halloween? October. October. When is uh, Independence Day? September. 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 Okay, very good. Now, let's see. We need to know the ordinal numbers because of this. Let me, let me show you this first. The date, how to say the date in English. Okay, we have two forms, American way and British and rest of the world way. Okay, so gringos siempre llevan la contraria. <laughs> American way. Written English, en forma escrita. March 7, vean, American Way, primero va el month y después day. March 7. British and rest of the world. Way is day plus month. month. 
y se lee 7th of seventh. March. The 7th of March. 7th of March. In American English, March. se lee March 7th. March 7th. 7th. Yes. Aunque acá yeah. no se escriba con of ordinal March. nombre. La pronunciación sí siempre es ordinal nombre. Okay, esto es ordinal number, 7th, 7th of March. 7th of March. Y cuando ponemos la fecha solo en números, ustedes ya han llenado algún formulario, ¿verdad? En internet, en in English, en in American English, va month, day, year. British English and okay. rest of the world day, month, year. Yeah. Okay? Entonces, dado que we always use ordinal numbers to say the date when you we speak por eso es que tenemos que estudiar rapidito de ordinal number. No, no, no. Ok. No. Ya se lo voy a copiar ahí en el WhatsApp. ¿Cómo formamos los ordinal numbers? Well, we normally add a TH to the end of a cardinal number to make it an ordinal number. O sea, normalmente le agregamos esta TH al final de cada número cardinal para hacerlo ordinal. Miren qué sencillo. En español, qué complicado es. So, be careful of the spelling except, exceptions below. Hay excepción. La mayoría de los casos solo se agrega TH. Excepto estos que están en rojo. Por ejemplo, primero, first. Vea, no se le pone TH. Es otra forma. ST. First. first. Segundo, second. Tercero, third. Oh. Ya acá ya vamos con fourth, oh. fifth. Oh. Y cambio un poco la escritura. Vea, fifth. no es five sino que fifth, sí. sixth, sí. seventh, sí. Seven. esa TH la estoy exagerando un poco para que se escuche. Seven. Eighth, Eighth. ninth, ninth. Tenth. tenth. Okay. Tenth. Vea. Seventh. Solo tenemos first, second y third, que son de abreviación diferente. Y de ahí los demás van con TH. Fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. Eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, 19th, 20th, 20th, ok, luego, 21st. miren que en español es más complicado, vigésimo primero, vigésimo segundo, en inglés es sencillo, no, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, 31st, 40th, 41st, 50th, 51st, 
Ok. Como repito, estos que están marcados en rojo, <coughs> la escritura cambia un poco. ¿Alguna pregunta acá? No question, teacher. Mm -hmm. Y sí. Ok. Entonces voy a ponerles imágenes ahí en el Give me a second. Oh. Ay, está cargando. Ok, and ordinal numbers. No, ordinal numbers are. Y how to say the day. Un par de detallitos más sobre la fecha. Bien, veamos. Como dice acá. We always use ordinal numbers for the date in spoken English. Ok. En inglés hablado. We always use ordinal numbers. In English. Month always start with capital letters. Capital letters. ¿Qué es capital letter? Esta. Letra mayúscula. Letra mayúscula. Correcto. ¿Ok? En español, como saben, no va en capital letter. ¿Ok? En English, always. Month, always start with capital letter. Y luego, los años. Years are normally divided into two parts. Normalmente se dividen los años en two parts. 1984 se lee 19-84. 19-84. Este sería 1652-1941-2017. Excepción. For the years from 2000 to 2010, we normally say 2000 and The number. Por ejemplo, decimos 2006, 2006. No decimos 2006. No, normalmente del 2000 al 2010 decimos 2001, 2002, 2003, 2004. 2006, 2007, 2008, 2009, 2010. Y de ahí para allá, sí, 2011, 2012, 2013. Y actualmente estamos en el 2022. Ok. 
any question? No questions, okay. So if I ask you, when were you born? Let me write it here in the whiteboard. Si yo les pregunto, when were you born? Cuando nacimos. The answer is, I was born on August 27, 1964. Okay. When were you born? I was born on August 27th, 1964. What about you? Let me ask two. Okay. Miguel, when were you born? I was born on June 5th, 1991. Okay. Miguel, ask Oscar, please. Oscar, when were you born? I was born on March 12th and a Night nineteen seventy five seventy C. Pero me cuál es inglés. Nighty quiero ver cómo escribirlo. Nighty seventy six. Nighty seventy six. Okay. Okay, Oscar. Ask Edgar. Edgar, when when were you were you born? I I was born on April twenty first, nineteen seventy five. Hey, hey, equals the same year. The same <laughs> year. I, I I am old. No, te veo bien bicho. Ah, hey Elga, <laughs> Andrea. Uh, Andrea, when were you born? I was born on July 2nd, 1996. Okay. Andrea, ask Blanca. Blanca, when were you born? I was born on August 11. 1979. 1979. Hey, Blanca, ask Johnny. Johnny, when were you born? Hi, Blanca, I was born on August 25, 87. Hey. What is the ordinal for 25, Johnny? 25. 25th. 25th. Yes. 25th. Okay. I don't Good. remember. Sorry. Yeah, it's different. It's different. No problem. Okay. Johnny, ask Rodrigo. Rodrigo, when were you born? I was born on April 7th, 1985. Okay, be careful people because it's different. Algunos les escucho 90. No es lo mismo 90 que 19. 
Nairi is Nairi. Nineteen. Nineteen. Escucha ese teen. Okay. Okay, Rodrigo, ask Gerson. Person, when were you born? I was born on September 1990. Okay. Okay, Herson, ask Ivan. Ivan, when were you born? I was born on March uh, 8. 1988. Good. Ivan, ask Manuel. Manuel, when were you born? I was born. I was born on June 25th, 1993. Okay. Manuel, ask uh, Rafael. Rafael, when were you born? I was born on November 22nd, 1995. 5th, 95th. No, con los años no es ordinal nombre. Con los años sí está bien, 95. 95, es okay. Es ordinal nombre. Oops. Okay. Rafael, ask Fernando. Fernando, when were you born? I was born on August, yes, August 1964. 20, 1994, August 27, like me. Wow. Hey, we have the same birthday. Naciste el mismo día que el teacher, Vercho. Ah, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Un solo pastel, vamos a comprar el otro año. Okay. Okay, very good. Any question, people? Eh, yo, teacher. Uh -huh. eh, el año, eh, si es posible mencionarlo como los noventas, ¿cómo se mencionaría ahí? Los noventas. Ajá, por así decirlo. The nineties. Ajá, pero si me preguntan a mí, podría responder como eh, on the nineties. Sí, sí. Yo nací en los noventas. I was born in the 90s. In the 90s. Yes. Okay. okay. Thanks, 90s. teacher. Yeah. Okay. Any other question? Very good. Let's see if I think I have something to practice or not. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me get it here. Okay, so se lo dejo ahí para que practique. Yeah, no time today. Finish your class. All, we're almost done. Yeah. 
chicos, ¿cómo van con las tareas y el examen final? Finish. Good. Finish. Good. Ok. Voy okay. a ver. Ah, ahora tiene que estar todito eso. A ver, tarea, tarea. Ah, uno. Ah. En el examen. Y un par de... Hay que hacer ahora el examen final. Dicho. No, el final no, el de medio curso. Ah, ok. No, ya ah, en la unidad 2. Ah. Ok, sí, eh. uno que otro falta nada más. La mayoría sí ya está. Ready. Perfect. Congratulations. Good boys, good girls. Teacher, teacher, ¿puedo interrumpir un, una, con una pregunta? Claro. Eh, fíjense que ahora estaba hablando con mi jefe y, y me preguntó si, se puede, si eh, puedo conseguir seguir en el curso, pero hay que hacer el mismo requisito de inscripción. ¿O es automático? No. Tiene que llenar todo. todo. De hecho, ya es... Estamos en las segunda semana y ya tiene que empezar a recolectar todo y a hablar con recursos humanos para inscribirse en el siguiente módulo. Ok. Gracias, teacher. Ok. Last attendance of the evening. Ana Celia Mena didn't show up. Ana María Marcela Siu. No, se, se le apagó el teléfono. Apagó. Estaba manejando. Ok. Andrea Carolina Ortiz. Present. Good. Blanca Isabel Tunaca. Present. Perfect. Diana Vanessa López. Didn't show up. Edgar Eduardo García. Present teacher. Excellent. Edith Marisa Gómez. Fernando Salvador Figueroa. Present teacher. Perfect. Gerson Orlando Diodanes. Present. Perfect. Glenda Margarita Ortiz. Irma Mercedes Flores. Present teacher. Excellent. Iván Alberto Castillo. Present. Okay. Johnny Alexander Escobar. Present teacher. Perfect. Jocelyn Angelina. Didn't show up. Manuel Alberto Mena. Present. Ok. Miguel Ángel Romero. Present. Ok. Oscar René Molina. Present, teacher. Ok. Rafael Antonio Martínez. Present, teacher. Good. Raúl Enrique Campos. Rodrigo Enrique Hernández. Present. Ok. Y Ana Lizeth Pérez y Juan Balmore. Bueno, los 10 minutos, ¿a quién le tocan? Nos vemos. Le tocan a Glenda, pero no está. Ok, people. Si alguien lo quiere, yo aquí me tengo que quedar y todo a mandar los 10 minutos. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Good night. Gracias, teacher, por la clase. Feliz noche a todos. Bye, bye. dreams.